it is 11:27 a.m wednesday morning september 13th 2023 we're aboard the <coughs> cumbries and toltec scenic railroad train op going from chama new mexico to antonito colorado we just departed the summit of cumbries pass cumbries colorado at 10,000 feet above sea level and soon we will be going around Tanglefoot Curve. We have uh, eight passenger cars, including a gun. You can ride in one of the eight, one of the seven passenger cars is a power car. We have uh, former Denver and Rio Grande Western Railroad K36282 number 484, 484, 484 pulling us. Built for the Denver and Rio Grande Western Railroad in 1925 by the Baldwin Locomotive Works. Oh, here's the Wyatt Cumbries. There's a little bit of the snowshed remains. So the 484 was built by the Baldwin Locomotive Works in 1925 at uh, Eddystone, Pennsylvania. The last year of operation by the Denver and Rio Grande Ra Western Railroad on this narrow gauge three foot line was 1968. Narrow gauge freights running between Alamosa, Antonito, over Cumbries Pass here, Chama on west of Durango, and then south down the branch to Farmington. Came up a four percent grade from Chama to Cumbries. Now we're going going down a grade. I think it's maybe three percent. track in the distance at a lower elevation we'll be going on that track so we're going to be going around Tanglefoot Curve there's the track we'll be on before long OCR, O-S-I-E-R, Colorado, zero population or stopping, we're going to have a lunch stop. Here you can see Tanglefoot Curve in the distance like a horseshoe curve.
Look at the cows. Are following us in case of a fire set by our steam locomotive 484. Look at that vista. a.m. Wednesday morning, September 13th, 2023, aboard the Cumbries and Coltec Scenic Railroad passenger train running from Chaman, New Mexico to Antonita, Colorado, now east of Cumbries, Colorado, over and out. <laughs> 